Hey, 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 what's going on, everybody? It's a tireless rocker. Greetings, fellow Golkari drinkers. My name is the Tireless Rocker. If you love fair, interactive mid range magic, you came to the right place. I'm going to release two videos every Alright, guys, morning. today we're going to do a little bit of a post companion, uh, post companion nerf deck tech for spirits. So, Companions got nerfed on June 3rd, and right away, Jagatha is no longer being played. I'm not sure if that's completely correct, but I am excited at the possibility of some different cards. So, let's, uh, let's analyze these two lists here. So, before we get into that, actually, there's this new deck that's been, uh, I've been playing against a lot. It's a new deck. It's the deck, is this deck right here? This is the deck list. So, how it works is they use uh, Eldritch Evolution, okay, and what they do is they sack any two mana creature like Self of Spirit uh, or Voice of Resurgence, and then that's a that's actually a really good target to sack, and then they get Winota, which is the new card, and with Winota. Every other creature in the deck almost is a non-human. There's a lot of non-humans in the deck. And uh, yeah, there's some humans. But anyways, every time a non-human attacks, they get to um, look at the top six cards. And then this card can make certain cards do like 18 damage. Like double. Once they can get two of these on the field and then it's double, double. So one of if they have two of these, they'll hit for like 16. So anyways, with this in mind, I kind of want to... Oh, also, Winota has been banned uh, or suspended in Historic recently. So Wizard's Nose is a problem and people are currently... A lot of people are playing this deck. So let's look at what cards are good against it. And I feel that... Us Settle the Wreckage is really good. So, I kind of want to bring back a set of the wreckage into into the deck. So we are top. We we are we're on the top eight, uh top uh, list here on the MTG decks too. So this is our list. We haven't been changing anything. So what I'm gonna try this time is I'm going to take out Gigantha and Seal Away, and I'm gonna put in two set of the wreckages. And I also want to try Ojutai's command. In the last episode, I talked about why uh, I thought that was kind of an interesting card. Let's change things up a bit. I personally don't like Dromoka's command as much. And instead of playing Back to Nature, which is an instant, it doesn't get hit by Coco, I might try a Knight of Autumn. So I'm going to go uh, on card orders now and buy some of these decks. And let's, I'll get back right here all right oh judai's command is only a two cents so get some of those all right so let's bring in the settler wreckage i mean it's good in in many matchups and with Gigantha no longer in our deck we're able to play um more settles because it's uh it has a double white mana symbol all right we don't own knight of autumn let's buy it Kind of expensive. Well, not expensive. Well, I'll just buy one. And actually, um, Disdainful hasn't been as good because Gyruda got nerfed severely. And it's not an instant source. It's not a creature, so it doesn't get hit by Coco. One note against uh, a Jutai's command, in my opinion, is I feel like in grindy matchups, and in most matchups where a Jutai's command is good, where you know usually when they have removal like against mid-range decks and where we need to draw a card uh collected company is also really good but um all right we bought the cards all right so yeah i was saying a jutai's command is it doesn't synergize with collected company i mean i mean we're only playing one it might not make much of a difference but the gain for life one 
could be pretty relevant against aggro matchups because in aggro matchups sometimes we take out collected company or two so it kind of balances it balances out how we we're bringing in a non-creature spell making collected company not as good by having less collected company so yeah um we'll try it out anyways let's just keep it fresh let's try it it could be really good all right a Jew dice command and we'll bring in yeah knight Oh, a lot of knights. Yeah, we'll bring in a knight. Just try some new cards. I think this looks pretty good. Anol has still been uh, uh, decent at times. Hmm, I do want to make room for Remorseful Cleric. Hmm, what should I take out? So the latest two lists of Valjagantha, they're not playing a null anymore but there is a back to nature i'm kind of thinking about maybe taking out a null mystical seems to be a pretty strict four of hmm hmm i think we need some kind of grave hate yeah let's for this league let's just take out an annul and uh just leave in the remorseful cleric and this yeah this looks pretty decent let's try it out guys well we haven't changed our deck list since uh companions have been a thing it's gonna be june 9 and uh don't worry about uh link in the description anymore because i'm just gonna put it uh, on the side of uh, each video